Hey there and welcome back to my channel. My name is Georgina and I'm the Honest Vocal Coach. So today we're doing a little bit of a twist on the vocal so it's not exactly a vocal battle in the way that we normally do it. We're doing it a little bit different. So today, because of the new film just coming out of Cats, with Taylor Swift and Jennifer Hudson in it and all these other awesome people, um, we're going to be looking at the big bit of memory. Who sings the final part of memory the best? Ooh! This time, I ain't going to decide, but I'm going to give you my opinion on it. And I want you to decide who your favourite is of the performance. And tomorrow, I'm going to be reviewing the new version of Memory by Jennifer Hudson, her first live performance of it. So make sure you watch tomorrow, Musical Theatre Monday. So, no scores today. It's up to you. Let's dive in. Oh my god stunning probably my favorite all-time version of the sort of memory really by elaine page now all of these other clips on here i haven't seen these yet so who knows if elaine's still gonna be my all-time favorite version eee! it's exciting stuff so elaine does it in a very belty way it's very emotional she really goes for it very high belt Okay, not too bad. Not as much emotional quality. Belt was good though. It just didn't have that emotional element for me. But technique wise, vocally, it was pretty good. Now, did you notice on that one, she slid off. Touch me! She kind of, that was a bit weird. She kind of slid off the note. Vocally very good, again, belted, powerful, but I don't know, I just, it didn't connect with me, that one. I felt it was just a little bit over the top. I don't know. Now, I love a bit of Celine Dion. She has a wonderful voice. But for me, too riffy. I think there was too much going on. It should be more subtle in the way that it's performed. But she was going a bit more entertainment value, I think. I quite like that actually. I thought that was good, but it felt a little bit fast, don't you think? I think maybe slow it down a little bit. Very well sung, beautiful technique. Du verstehst, was 
Now, I thought that was a bit much to start off with. It was very, very kind of a little bit shrill. But when she pulled it back, the emotion was beautiful. The technique was beautiful. That was a good version. <laughs> Okay, she used a few more slides. What happiness is on hers. But that was up there with Elaine for me. I've never heard of that woman before. Oh my God, why have I not heard of her? That was great. my god i love her i love her queen of musical theater that was a really good version very well supported very very powerful but it still had the emotional quality If you touch me, you'll understand what happiness is. I really liked how he did the extra note there. What happiness is. He has such a wonderful voice, does John Barrowman. I'm a big fan. Oh my goodness, this is an interesting version of the song. I like it actually, I really do. It didn't get me really. There was a lot of emotion there. Great technique. There hasn't been anybody with dodgy technique in this so far. There's been different choices of, you know, notes and stuff, but this is a great selection. Carrie Ellis is stunning. I did a masterclass with her earlier this year and it was fabulous. I'll put a link to the end at the end of the video so you can watch the masterclass if you want.
was a great version by Leona there. Really good. You, the emotion was there. Powerful. Wow. She could definitely go off into that musical theatre arena, don't you think? <laughs> Now that was really good. That's up there. There hasn't really been a dodgy one for me. It was only the Glee one I wasn't so sure of. Everything else has been phenomenal. Really difficult to choose. a little bit of warmth for me it was all very kind of shrill head tones it lacked that that warmth she uses a lot of a sounds in her singing kind of a harder vowel really God, that was amazing. That was a really, oh my, I don't know who this lady is. I've not heard of her before. That was awesome. Look on you. Wow, what a selection of incredible singers.